Hey everybody, it's Kim here with Lolly Doodle Studios. I am going live tonight as part of the fundraiser for the Beck family. I am a part of the Crafty Bunch event here. Um, so we have 30 minutes and what we're going to do is I'm going to paint and I've started. I've started already because 30 minutes goes real, real, real fast. Um, and then at the end, I am going to auction off the piece that I'm painting. So um, I just want to make sure I see some people coming on. So I'm assuming that I am live in the correct place. I'm going to be painting and hand lettering a piece um, with some angel wings, which is funny because I've seen a couple of angels today and I love that. Hi, Jeannie. How are you? Thank you for tuning in. I'm just trying to pull it up on my laptop so that I can see comments. Okay, I see it now. And then I'm going to move the camera down. Hey, Christy. Thank you all for tuning in. So although I do not know the Beck family um, personally, I, I am aware of them and I do follow their page Rekindled Blessings. And if you are not aware, if you have not been watching the other artists today and all week long, there are different groups. Hey girl, Nana's Workshops in the house. Hi, my sweet friend, Franny, hello. Um, if you are not aware and you do not follow them, um, we I am part of this fundraiser tonight to try to raise the money. They lost their daughter in a tragedy. Hi, Debbie. How are you? Um, I'm going to keep talking, but point the camera down. And you'll see I did start. I already started, guys, because 30 minutes goes really fast. And the piece that I want to do... Um, I, I want to really just make it special. So I am aware that it may look upside down. Oh, shoot. Stupid camera. Um, hi, Mary. How are you, girl? Thank you for tuning in. All right. I think we have a decent view there. And I'll see if I can flip. Nope. Wrong button. Let me just give it two seconds and see if I can flip. If not, we are not going to worry about it. Okay. So you'll see here, I have a wood board. Um, Nana, thank you, girl. Thank you, Shannon. Um, I've just painted the base. It's like a wood. It's stained wood on the side. I've painted the background very plain. And I've started my wings because I want to be able to at least get most of this finished while we are live and I've used a chalk marker just to letter my words they'll probably go away as I put my fingers through it um thank you for tuning in celebrations creations thank you so much I have been trying I've popped in and out of everyone's lives today um I was working so don't tell my boss but I have caught almost everybody, I think, at some point in time. And there are some amazing projects. Uh, so if you have not seen them all, please go back and watch. Um, but anyway, as I was saying, what's going to happen is at the end of this, I am then going to auction this piece off. So I'm not so much going to be teaching what I'm doing, but just kind of painting um, and if you are new here and you don't know my story, thank you for sprinkling. I, I love those sprinkles. I myself have lost my mother and my husband within 28 days of each other. And that was about seven years ago. Um, and I have a child with special needs. Uh, but when I heard the loss um, I heard about the loss uh, for Beth and Randy. Um, it just absolutely broke my heart. So I just thought what better thing for me to paint is what started all of this off for myself and will paint some wings. 
So I did start the one side because I want to be able to finish most of it so that you will see what it looks like. Thank you, thank you. But, you know, that's why I love this crafty community as we've seen all day today and so many times in the past is that there is such a blessing in this whole crafting thing. Not only just the art and what it does for us and ourselves, but we all band. It's just amazing. We Like, you don't even have to know the person uh, personally uh, but we all just band together um, like so many are doing this week to help the Beck family. Um, so I'm just adding some angel wings or angel feathers in here into my wings. I hope that you're able to see it okay. Rose, thank you for the sprinkle. Thank you, Ida. Thank you for spreading the love and blessings. Uh, we all need that, right? So I am an artist. I am a hand letterer. Um, and as my name suggests, and I just told you, I became a widow in my early 40s. So I'm not a stranger to loss. Um, and it absolutely broke my heart to hear the news. So did I want to be a part of this event today? Absolutely. And whatever money is raised for this piece at the end, um, will go towards that. So I do like to teach art. Um, if you follow my page, uh, if you'd like to learn a little bit, please follow, um, like and follow me here on the page. Um, I usually talk way too much. <laughs> Thank you guys for tuning in. I believe that I'm the last presenter of the evening. If I'm not, you guys um, can let me know. And if someone could drop the link in to the GoFundMe for me in the comments, I would greatly appreciate that, guys. Um, so yeah, as I was saying at the very end, um, if anyone does want to bid. Hello, Sunshine Shipley. Thank you so much for sending hugs. Um, what will happen is whatever the end bid. You became a widow in your early 40s too, Edith. Yep, I have two children. Um, my oldest is a child with special needs, Alexis. Uh, and that is where my page name came from because she always said her name was Lolly. Um, so yeah, that's a little bit about me. Um, so there's some wings. I started painting wings after my loss helped me through my depression. Michelle, you didn't realize that, girlfriend? Yes, ma'am. Alexis herself is very lucky to be here as well. Sorry, I don't know that one. Oh, my Alexa likes to talk when I say Alexis. So yeah, any sprinkles out into this metaverse would be greatly appreciated. I did start a little bit early because I want to make sure you guys get to see this. So we're seven minutes in. I just like to layer my pieces. I'm gonna switch brushes. So have you all been watching all day? Um, there have been some incredibly, incredibly talented people here today sharing their crafts sharing their talent all for an amazing cause genie's palette thank you thank you for doing that sister i appreciate you popping that in there for me so i like to add a lot of little wispies and 
texture to my art pieces, like these wings. Just a little. So even if you feel that you cannot bid, Laura, you've watched all day as well. Perfect. Thank you so much for that. Um, if you've missed any of the crafters and you want to go back and watch, thank you. Celebrate beautiful. Um, yes. And if you have paid, just make sure you let me know that I love to support. Oh, Edith, your second child was born with a rib caught in your rib. Okay. She throws her leg. Yes. Alexis, um, has mild CP, so she, she tippy-toe walks. Um, but anyway, and you give me, you show me a good cause and I'm there. It doesn't even matter if I know them or not. You know, that's just part of being an empathetic human. Um, so I just want you to see here how I add some of the wispies to the feathers. And I will make sure that this piece is nice and full and lush with lots of texture thank you painting crafty i love to paint on dark wood i don't know why um but i do and then we're going to letter this here in just a few minutes So I'll go back and add the wispies on that side after we do some of the lettering because I'm a lefty letterer and I run my hand through everything so I have to be careful. Tammy, your daughter has mild CP too. Yep, Lexi's been a tippy-toe walker all her life. She's had all the surgeries and nothing really was able to correct her tippy-toe walking. So we just tippy-toe around the house here. Um... Yes, Franny, that I love you. If you've followed me for a long time, you know I love the movement and the texture and the painting. Um, okay, I don't know. I lost your comment there, girlfriend. I saw it and then it went away. Um, so anyway, I'm just getting a smaller brush now. And I did paint that feather, so I bet you I'll put my hands in it. And some some people think I'm strange, but I will do my lettering first uh, with a chalk marker or a pencil. And then I will come back in and I tend to paint backwards because um, I always put my finger in it. I hope that you can see what I'm doing here. Thank you, Marjorie. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, hang out here for a little bit. I'll have you painting in no time. I always say this, it's only paint. The worst thing's going to happen is you don't like what you did. You paint over it and you start again. Not loving this brush, but it will work. I don't want to rush through it too, too much that I'm not happy with it, but I just want you guys to get the gist of what I'm doing. Um, and please feel free to share the video out and about for anyone else you might think um, might like this sort of thing. We'll probably need two coats. Michelle, thank you so much for that. I love you, sister. I love our community. We're, um, everyone is amazing, honestly. I love our community. So let's see. It's probably going to need two coats. And 
I am not loving this brush, so let me see if one of my other brushes will be nice to me tonight. I have a new brush. Let's switch over to the new brush. Hi, Cheryl. Thank you, dear. Yes, guys, please, you know, do the whole like, sprinkle, follow if you wish thing. Um, especially for tonight. It's for such a good cause for the Beck family. I am the last presenter of the evening, um, but I do want to stick to my time allowed um, as closely as possible. Yeah, this brush is better. This brush is better. So many amazing projects today. I know there are at least two, if not more, fundraisers in the next two days. Um, you're going to do some wood burning this week, Fran? Oh, I love to see it. I lent my wood burner out to a friend and never got it back. Thank you, Lydia. I think great minds think alike, right? So I just want to get some of the lettering on. I'll go back and put a second coat over the lettering as well. I just thought this was an ama a great quote um, considering the circumstances. Huh, I know, sure, all right. Hey, you know what they say, you know, don't lend things out or, you know, don't lend money, don't lend your things out if, you know, it happens, right? Um, but anyway, I'm better with a paintbrush anyway. We'll put it that way. So I just used, um, chalk marker to write the lettering on first. That way, if I go outside of the lines, um, that I've written, it's easy for me just to wipe it off, but it will be sealed, um, a second coat will go on. It'll just look perfect before it goes out the door. lettering at all so we're not even going to follow the lines there thank you Nelly thank you for coming over I'm just letting the wings dry a little bit um, and then we'll put another layer on thank you so much guys all those hearts that just blesses this page and will bless this event so much greatly appreciated um so yeah when i do when we do the auction at the end uh, what you will do is just go ahead over to the gofundme um whoever's the winner of the bid you will just do that send me a screenshot showing that you've done that um, and then I will send this out. I will pay shipping so you don't have to worry about that. Um, thank you, Lydia. I know I just thought this was perfect considering 
the circumstances. It's always been one of my favorite verses. Uh, and after I lost my mom and my husband, um, fell into a very deep depression, very dark. Um, and painting was one of the big factors for me to feel better. So I know painting angels at that time is what got my page started. So I figured what better way, and I haven't painted a wing in a really, really long time, guys. So I was a little nervous. That's why I started a little bit ahead of time because I thought, well, this is a lofty little project here for a 30 minute event, but we're gonna do it. I'm trying to watch my time. So I've been on about 20 minutes. We're doing great with time. Thank you, honey. Thank you so much. I will go back and read every comment again. I will follow all of your pages if I have not already. Um, I just love this crafting community. It's amazing. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the lettering alone for now. It will need a second coat but I wanna go back in with the wings and add just a few little more touches of some gold highlight. Hey, Connie girl. I know I'm glad you popped in. I was just saying, I have not painted wings in a really, really, really long time. Thank you, Kim. Thank you for coming over. Guys, you are blowing me away. 40 people watching tonight for such a good, good cause. Thank you so much. And if you can see that, it's just a little bit of gold highlight in some of these wings. I will probably keep working on it after the event. Um, but in about, I guess, four minutes, we'll start the bidding. I know, Connie. Hey, Lydia, you can always do it, right? I was debating, do I want to add the gold? Do I not want to add the gold? And I thought, why not? So I'm just going to add a little bit to this wing here. And I'm just, look. I don't go for perfection. I go for what feels right. You know, beauty's the eye of the beholder. What I like, someone else might not like at all. I don't know what that bang was. Oh, that's right. You resined it. I'm sorry. I forgot. But it looked beautiful. Michelle, the gold is perfect, isn't it? Michelle, will you do me a favor? Um, when I start this auction here in a couple of minutes, and I'm going to um, set a timer. Will you pop the stop in the comments for me, girlfriend? Cheryl, you lost your sister and sister-in-law a month ago. I am so sorry to hear that. I really am. The best advice I can give you is, and as much as it sucks, excuse my language, you have to feel it to heal it. And it's been seven years for me, and there are still days where the pain is unbearable. Whenever I hear of a loss, it just breaks my heart. So it never goes away, but... <sighs> I have a painting that I did of a mermaid. Um, so she was trying trying to hold back the waves because to me, that's what grief is. It comes in waves. You can never stop the waves, but we can hold them back a little bit. 
Nellie, thank you so much. All right, we're getting close to time that I will have to start the auction, but don't worry. He will leave, She, he or she, Angel Wings, will leave this house. It isn't easy, Shay, is it? Um, it won't leave here until I am completely 100% happy with it. Got to find that brush I had. Here it is. Let's see if we can add just a few more wispies before time. Yep. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lydia. I'm sorry for your loss. It just seems that there's so much. You know, sometimes I think this whole painting thing, well, is it really helping anybody or anything? You know, I mean, it helps me. Um, but I just feel like that is the one little thing that I have, my little gift back to put a little bit of peace, a little bit of love back into the universe. Um, and really the only way that I know how um, through my art. So yeah, I'm just gonna add some wispies to this side. Connie, your mom passed away. Oh, I'm sorry for your loss. See, there's so much loss. And that's why I think we all need each other so much. We need each other to lift each other up. And thank you, Laura. Oh, Cheryl, thank you for that. Let's see. Um, I think we all need each other so much and just watching someone craft or learning a new technique from someone if you like art things like that it just just helps the spirit thank you for those hearts again oh Edith God bless you honey we all have a story don't we We all have a story. You have a timer ready? Let's see what time is it. It's time. Um, so rest assured, this will leave this house absolutely 100% beautiful, perfect. Um, any little blemishes, like I see something there I don't like, I will fix. We'll leave here beautifully, perfectly sealed. So why don't we go ahead. Um, can we start the bid? Can we start the bid at 25 and then do a two minute timer, Michelle and Michelle will put in stop. So we'll start the bid now at 25. I'll try to hold it. Um, thank you, Rustic Daisies. So we'll start the bid now at 25. Michelle is there. She will put in um, oh, we have 30, 35, 25. I stress over these things, wondering if anyone will even want it. But you guys, it's for such a good cause. It really is. So we have a high bit of 35 so far. As soon as we see Michelle of Divine Designs, 38. She will place the stop. She's running the timer for me. So 38 for Cheryl. We have a 40 from Susan. The gold, I don't know if you can even see it, but the gold is really shiny up. We have a 40. $40 bid. That gold is just so beautiful. We have a 42. And every bit of this will go to the Beck family. Uh, whatever they're not using for the burial of their daughter um, will go into an education fund for the granddaughter. Thank you, Cheryl. We have a high bid. Michelle, what do you think? We have about a minute left, you think? Maybe not even. 
So we're at 42 right now. We have less than a minute left, guys. Less than a minute. We're at $42. Michelle, there goes the stop. So Cheryl Horn, you have the sign at $42. Thank you, Michelle, for doing the timer for me, sweetie. Cheryl, all I need for you to do is go over to the fundraiser. Uh, Michelle, drop, I, someone dropped the link in here, and I will post it again when I get off. Just send me a screenshot of your donation along with your address, and I will get this out in the mail to you. Thank you, Rita. Well, I want to thank you. On my behalf and on behalf of all of the presenters today in the Crafty Bunch for supporting us for such a good cause. I've enjoyed meeting so many new friends. I'm following so many more pages that I never even knew existed. And I loved each and every one of you stopping by here with me tonight. I love you. I will finish this up and get it shipped out. Um, and have a blessed night, guys. Let me just turn this around here again so you can see my face. Thank you again. It means the world. Um, I'll be back. Have a good night, guys. I love you. Bye.